Hello dear viewers, Assalamu alaikum. I am engineer Muhammad Rezaul Haq. Welcome to my automation tools YouTube channel. We know today's most of the industries are using vibrantly Nevada 3500 vibration monitoring system to measure the vibration, temperature and axial displacement. ATP logics also made in the relay module in vibration system. If any value of the vibration, axial displacement and temperature is gone beyond to setting value, then the turbine or compressor will be tripped. Today, I will show how to make a logic program in Bentley Nevada 3500 vibration monitoring system. So, let's start. First, we open the rack configuration software. This software is used to configure the different module of the 3500 vibration modules uh, vibration system. We know if we want to make a logic programming relay module, first we have to be configured the proximeter, temperature, all of the module have to be configured. I have already configured this. I am opening this configuration. So go to open and uh, open this logic configuration you see our configuration is open here is a proximeter sensor proximeter monitor here are the vibration axial displacement are configured is here and this is the temperature transmitter temperature module that here the temperature is in already configured you can see you see here is all configured configured you can see vibration is configured is here same as the temperature is also configured is here you see already configured i have made the real, uh, logic program by using this proximeter the third position and the temperature transmit, temperature monitor for that first we select the first we insert the relay module so select slot then go to relays then go to the standard module then 3500 probably 32M. Okay, you see, configured. Now we want to make the logic from here. Logic in this module, so go to the option and double click and click on the module. You see, here you can see the slot number is 345, the proximeter monitor, proximeter monitor, proximeter monitor, and temperature monitor in the slot 6. You see. In the slot 6 temperature module and 3, 4, 5 is the proximeter monitor. Here you can see the vibration, axial displacement, also the showing is here. We want to make the logic program by using this. First, I will show what I want to do. You see, this is the radial vibration logic diagram for channel 1. In that issue, a channel area is for channel channel 1, channel 1 I want to make this logic program, this logic program I want to make in the channel 1, you see have the vibration is a name, name is a 110 x, 110, 100, 101 and 102 and 103, both of the vibration, all of the vibration has the x vibration and y vibration, x and y vibration are being n gate, one, uh, 100 x also n gate, one, uh, all of the x and y vibration become n gate and of the vibration go to the or gate. If the any one of the vibration is x and y at a time become high, high then the turbine will be tripped. So I make this logic. If you note carefully notice this, you can easily understand. It's the same VT 100x and 100y in n gate. Sorry, n gate. So I doing this channel one. First you select channel one. You channel which channel one? So select channel one and go to the here first the first bracket then you go to the channel 1 In channel 1 is the VT 100X so take this then there just keep and press then it's end gate so select the end then go to the Y what is Y it is a 100 Y so select this 100 Y now a close the bracket that means say the 100 X and Y are in end gate Another all vibration are big, uh, big, uh, big between them are in the OR gate, so we select the OR, you see, to the OR, that means going to the OR gate. Then start the bracket, 
আমার হান্ড্রেড ইস কমপ্লিট হান্ড্রেড ওয়ান সো টেক দা হান্ড্রেড ওয়ান এক্স ভাইব্রেশন এন্ড গেট টেক দা হান্ড্রেড ওয়াই হান্ড্রেড ওয়ান ওয়াই ভাইব্রেশন ক্লোজ দা ব্র্যাকেট ইস কমপ্লিটেড দিস ওয়ান ইস কমপ্লিটেড অ্যানাদার ওয়ান ইস ইট গো টু দা ওয়ার গেট সো ইস ইস দা ওয়ার গেট নাও ইট ইস দা হান্ড্রেড টু এক্স এন্ড ওয়াই আই টেকিং মেকিং দিস এন্ড গেট বিটুইন দা হান্ড্রেড x and y vibration 102 x and y vibration so you see this is the channel 3 here is the 101 x vibration go to the and get and go to the 100 102 y vibration is where is the 102 y vibration is the 100 y vibration and close the bracket this is also is complete then another is 113 x vibration so again go to the or get so select the or then press the bracket go where is the x that is 103 x this is the 103 x danger vibration and i and get go to the 103 y go to 103 this is the 103 y and this vibration is close that means you see 1 2 3 4 all of the vibration 1 2 3 4 this is the 100 one high vibration this is the 102 high vibration this is the 103 this is the 103 high vibration and last one is the 104 high vibration and both of vibration are all of the vibration are going to or get if one of them both the x and y become high then the carbon will be trip so dear friend the vibration uh, channel one logic confusion is completed this is the for the uh, radial vibration then i go to the another channel to make the another logic so we select the channel 2 check to we want to the make a logic first i show the which logic i want to make this channel 2 so i go to the you see i make the temperature logic 2 this logic i want to make the in the i want to make this logic in module 2 so in the channel 2 channel 2 i am showing this temperature module you see here the six temperature in temperature module you see here you can see the temperature module go to the temperature module you see here the six temperature you see 100 to 1 to 106 giving two temperature in and get and both are good uh, all of the go to the or get if the two temperature at a time become high that means in say 101 and 102 at a time become high then the turbine will be trip if 101 and 103 become high then not the turbine will not be trip because uh, 101 is go to another and get uh, 103 go to another and get if only the 103 and 104 become then the high and the turbine will be trip i make this logic this the logic diagram that i want to make the logic in battery nevada system so if you careful notice you can easily understand so first press the bracket then 110 101 vibe uh, temperature so i take this danger alarm and is the and get so select and and channel 2 is the 102 so it's 102 and bracket is closed that means 101 and 102 in and get then and get is completed now 101 go to the or get so select the or again start in 101 103 and 104 in and get so select 103 this is the 103 103 and 104 is and get so select and then 104 104 select bracket is close it is 103 and and get is going to the or get so select or then again go to the another is 105 and 106 in and get so 105 we take the 105 this is the 105 you see 105 then 105 is in the and get so press and and 106 take the 106 and go to the you see 100 uh, 1 and 2 in the and get 103 and 4 in the and get and 104 and 5 uh, and 6 in the and get and both are go to the or get 
So I pick the plus sign or or get sign in between the temperature uh, temperature logic. So I have successfully complete the uh, temperature logic in the channel two. Now we may go to the channel three. In channel three we want to make the logic program for a thrust position. So first I show which program I want to make is here. This is the you see this is the thrust position logic. That will be used for the third channel diagram. Uh, the axial displacement. It is the here. Uh, here I am configured the two axial displacement is uh, 200 and three, uh, 201. 200 AB the two axial displacement and 201 also have the two uh, do, two axial displacement and both are this. Both ARB in the N gate and AB N gate go to the OR gate. I make this logic in channel three. So first we select the plus sign and we go where this you are using to see this is the ZT. This is the ZT 200 danger. I take this danger. This ZT 200 A in and B is N gate. So we select and then we take the Z to B. You see where is Z to B? This is the Z to B. Z to B take the Z 200 B and close. That means Z1, Z200 A and B in the end gate completed and both 200 A, B and 201 A were in OR gate. So, press OR then go to the another logic for the 201 A, B. 201 take the 201 danger, 201 A and B in the end gate. So, select end and then take the 200 1 B is and is completed and close the bracket. That means you see our logic is completed. You see 200 a b in the end gate. So a, this is the 200 a b in end gate and 201 a b in end gate, 201 end gate and both of this the axial displacement uh, end gate are in the OR gate. So I press the OR gate in between do this. If one of this pair is become high then the turbine will be tilted. If 200 a and 201A is become high, then the turbine will not treat. Because our logic is saying that if 200AB both are become high at a time, then the turbine will be treat. So, I have completed this uh, logic com uh, completion. Now, I check this is the channel 1 is the radial vibration, channel 2 is for the temperature, and channel 3 is for the thrust position, that means the axial displacement. So, our logic making is completed. So, press OK. After doing this, you now I will show the uh, configuration is okay or not okay. You see already completed. So go to the another of the set point. Set point is not available. So go to the point name. That we have to put this point name because how can you identify who is a who is a uh, logic is activated and the turbine is steep. So channel one we make the channel one the. Uh, they uh, have to make a name that we can uh, less with the uh, main controlling system that means DCS or ITCC. Uh, that means the ventilator never dies a part of this controlling system. Uh, this is uh, directly connected to the ESD system. When the ventilator never given high or the logic active, then it is a tip to the, uh, give a signal to the uh, ESD system, then it will be tip. So, we have to make a name that we can easily identify that which vibration will become high and the turbine is steep. So, radial vibration we select VT, high I, 100, and the temperature I taking the name is uh, TT, temperature transmitter high I, 101, and the ZT, so where the Z1, ZT, high high is 100. That if I have put this name, you can put, uh, take your name as per your requirement or as per your wish. So, after doing this, we can identify that when the same uh, vibration is higher than the this level, you can lessing with this one. Then you can understand that the vibration is high, high, temperature is high, high, and the is higher. Then you can see the uh, easily can be underpass. So, take this the point name, then after this, press OK. So, dear friend, our relay module configuration is completed. Now, we press the save button, the configuration is set. Then, when the say you directly connect to the rack configuration in life, then the it press download to the rack. Then, the configuration will be downloaded to the 
downloaded to the hardware. So, you can, uh, you can notice that uh, to make a logic program, first we have to be configured the proximeter, temperature, all you first you have to configure. Uh, in my previous video, I will show how can you configure this if you cannot uh, understand, uh, you cannot, you have missed this video. In the video description box, I will give the link, the configuration of proximeter and the temperature monitor module. You can see this from here. At last, I will show if you think that this my video is helpful for anything, please subscribe my channel if you already subscribe thank you so dear friend if you like my video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon also like comments and share thanks for watching